In this video we share Our Lady's message to Pedro Regis for June 11, 2022. Dear children, do not live away from prayer. When you are far from prayer, you become a target of the enemy of God. You are heading towards a future of great contempts for the sacred things. Great truths will be rejected and the great Babel will be present in the house of God. Do not turn away from the truth. Repent sincerely of your sins and seek the mercy of my Jesus through the sacrament of confession. When you feel weak, seek forces in the Eucharist and the victory of God will happen for you. I know each one of you by name and I will pray to my Jesus for you. Courage. It is in this life and not in another that you must testify that you belong to my son Jesus. Onward in defense of the truth. This is the message that I transmit to you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to reunite you here once more. I bless you, in the name of the Father, of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Stay in peace. With over 5,000 messages allegedly received by Pedro Regis since 1987, the body of material associated with the purported apparitions of Our Lady of Angora in Brazil is extremely substantial. At first glance, the messages may appear repetitive in terms of their consistent emphasis on certain central themes, the necessity to devote one's life wholly to God, faithfulness to the true magisterium of the Church, the importance of prayer, the Scriptures and the Eucharist. The Angora messages touch on a wide variety of subjects containing nothing incompatible with church teachings or approved private revelations. The position of the church towards the Angora apparitions is understandably one of caution, a commission has been established for the purposes of evaluation. It should be said that the current Archbishop of Feira de Santana is broadly supportive. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.